my channel, Child Free Millennial. If you're new here, hi, my name's Marcella. I'm 27, child free, living my best life. If you're old here, what's up? Okay, before I start this video, every time I show Jace, y'all are like, show him more. He's laying down on the floor. Give me a minute. Oh my gosh. Say hi, baby. What is up, everybody? Say hi. <laughs> Anyways, here's Jace, his lovely face, and he is so not happy to be on camera right now. So I'm gonna let him back down. That's 50 pounds of the cutest dog that you'll ever see. Don't anybody tell me that he's not the cutest dog. I don't wanna hear it because I already know he is. <laughs> nails of the day or of the week, I guess. I will link the Etsy shop below where I got these nails from. Okay, so there's been this trend that's been going around on TikTok. If you're not on TikTok, that's okay because I'm here to tell you what the trend is. Basically, there's these moms who are posting their kid and I'll show you in the next couple of videos, but there's moms who are posting their kids to this song, this really trendy song, showing what their baby looks like and then what they are named after. So they can be named after a character in a book or a TV show or like a, an inanimate object sometimes. And the thing that makes this trend so funny and the reason why I'm even making this video today is because people have taken the things that the baby is named after and have ran with it. You'll see it in the next couple examples, but oh my gosh, this is one of the funniest parent trends I have come across so far. And I just had to share it with y'all because I was in tears. I was laughing so hard when I first came across this. So I picked some of my favorite ones and I think the ones that you will find the most funny. So here we go. Oh Lord. Okay, so that's literally it. That's the whole trend right there. So this mom shared a picture of her baby. She's dancing, right? And then she shows pictures of what her baby is named after. And then this is where the funny part comes in. And I love the internet because people out there are just so funny. They're so clever, they're so witty. So these are what the comments say. <laughs> We've got East India Trading Company. <laughs> We've got Green Rock, Rock. Stock image is a beautiful name. Oh my gosh, that one took me out. You all know the stock images that are on everybody's wallpaper as soon as they purchase a laptop or a computer, desktop, whatever. Like that was perfection perfect comment. We've got, I also love the movie Blue Lagoon. Never thought it would make such a perfect name too. We got, oh, it's greenish blue. As a Disney lover, I laughed so hard when I saw this. They said, the heart of Tefiti is so pretty. Oh, I don't know, maybe these are just, maybe these are just funny to me, but like, oh, I'm gonna start crying, gosh dang it. I was laughing so hard. And obviously like, I don't even know what this kid's name is. I'm thinking it might be like Jade maybe, or like Indigo, but that really wasn't the color Indigo. And then I think of the island, I'm like, well shoot, is there an island named Jade? I don't know. And the thing is the parents never really expose what the kid's name is. It's really just to troll the comments to see the funniest name that somebody can come up with. Going back to the person that said rock, like genuinely, Tell me that there's not someone out there who thought about naming their kid Rock, or maybe there's already a person on this planet whose name is Rock. So these comments are not that far off. Like and the fact that somebody would name their kid Rock and the fact that like some of these names are actually valid. You'll see in the next video. Feel free to comment below any of your guesses to the baby names that I'm showing, because for me, I'm like, I genuinely don't know what this kid's name is. Okay, here's the next one. So it's the baby, cute, whatever. <laughs> okay, so really fast, really quick. You can see they put the four pictures. They had a nice little like resort. They have just $100 bills, gold nuggets, and then they have like space, right? So this one I did do some digging because I was like, what is this kid's name? Like I genuinely could not think of a name. Let me read you the comments before I tell you what the actual name. Comment below, pause the video and comment. What do you think this kid's name is? The gold nuggets, the cash, the fancy island, the stars. Like what do you think this kid's name is? <laughs> Mr. Worldwide <laughs> for Pitbull, um, white, boy, white boy Carl, which I don't think I get that reference. We've got Rich, which Richard, Rich, like that's a totally valid name. And I'm like, okay, I can I can see that like you'd have to be rich to have the island, the gold, the money. Maybe you have to be rich to get into space. I don't know. Bougie with I-E-G-H at the end, which I all the like Amberleys or Paisleys or Ainsleys or what's another cringy one? Oh my gosh, there's one that I heard the other day and I was like, this is the worst possible name that you can name your kid. Oh shoot, I'm blanking now, but we've got 32 pack of Hawaiian dinner rolls <laughs> because that baby was chunky. DJ Khaled, how adorable. We've got look at little financial freedom. 
I did some digging and I was like, what is this kid's name? So I go to the lady's profile and I scroll down a little bit and she made a post. What is his name? The grand reveal. His name is Lux. L-U-X-E. Expensive and of high quality. Who got it right? I'm not gonna lie. The name Lux is a lot better than some of the baby names that I've heard recently, like I named earlier. The ones that end in I-G-H or E-I-G-H. No, stop. If you're watching this video, if you're pregnant, if you're thinking of baby names, if you Googled best baby names and you somehow are on this video, which I don't know how the algorithm put you here, but do not name your kid with an E-I-G-H, I-G-H. Don't do it. Don't do it. Name your kid Lux. Like that's so much better than like a Kimberly, I-G. Like, I'm sorry, and if your name is Kimberly and you spell it E-I-G-H, you know what, I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> okay, on to the next one, we have this cute little girl walking on the, on the beach. <laughs> this one cracks me up. Okay, so, <laughs> bunch of plates, right? Different, like, China sets and whatnot. I was like, okay, what is her name? Her, her, her name could be China. Like, let's, let's be honest here. <laughs> yes, wedding China, you go, girl. <laughs> We've got go porcelain, go. Aw, plately. <laughs> This one took me out plainly with the E-I-G-H. What was I saying? Another one, you go ceramic. We've got, aw, Dishley is so cute. Aw, Chip from Beauty and the Beast. Plate, P-L-A-Y-T. We've got tea party table setup is a beautiful name. Old grandma's plate from the 80s. <laughs> White China, vintage. The thing is like somebody would actually name their kid vintage. Tea party Lee. And then we've got people saying like, not me stalking you to try to find her name. There was a comment where someone said, I went to her Instagram and saw it's Lenny, but now I'm just more confused. I think they meant to say Lennox because Lennox is a plate brand, a dish brand. But how many of you would have thought that? How many of you would have guessed after looking at those four pictures that her name was Lenny or Lennox? Not me. Oh my gosh, the plate Lee. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's so funny. Okay, we've got another one. Cute little baby sitting on a blanket with a play saw. Okay. Oh man, all those images are a little, we've got like just some forests, some trees. We've got a sauna or steam room, whatever that is. We've got what looks to be like walnuts or flowers. I can't be too sure. And then just like a piece of wood, some bark. <laughs> These ones made me laugh so hard. We've got bark, deforestation, <laughs> none other than Spruce Willis. <laughs> Could you imagine if someone named their kid Spruce? <laughs> oh my gosh, I bet you there's someone out there whose name is Spruce and I feel so bad for them. We've got little sauna, Timberly. We have saw, Woody Allen, assorted wood, Old Spice deodorant scent of cedar wood, and then the best one, tree. T-R-E-I-G-H. The thing is, and I know I've said this for every freaking name, but all the E-I-G-H's, like those are names that I am 100% confident that there is someone walking this earth today whose name is Tree. T-R-E-I-G-H. Like I can almost guarantee that. And that's alarming. Just stop naming your kids anything with E-I-G-H. For the love of everything that is good and holy, please, please just stop. I know I'm preaching to the choir. Okay, here's the last one I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, this one's so funny. Okay, so all mountain images, just mountaintops, snowy mountains. If I would have to guess what her name is, I would have to say, I actually have no guess. I was thinking Aspen just because it's a very trendy name right now. And I've heard people who have named their kid Aspen. I also, I also know that there's a place in Colorado. I believe it's Colorado, Aspen, Colorado, where you can ski and snowboard. But here are the responses from the Savage comments. Paramount Plus, that one sent me. You know, when you're watching a Paramount Plus movie at the beginning credits, they have the mountains. I'm always so amazed at how funny people are on the internet. We've got Ava Lanch, that's hilarious. We've got Snowy, so S-N-O-W. W E I G H. We've got Brokeback Mountain. <laughs> Lil Kilimanjaro. <laughs> ah, yes, Mountain, which again, that is another name that I can only imagine will become a trendy name 2050. Let's say 2050, Mountain's gonna be trendy. Everest Lee, <laughs> Toblerone, Halo Snowcap, Lil Coors Light, Peak. 
<laughs> That's great. The creator actually never told us what the name of the kid is, but now I'm convinced that their daughter's name is Corelight. <laughs> oh, that is all I have for you guys today. That was just a fun video and I wanted to share with you in case you are not on TikTok or you hadn't seen the trend. I went through, and I'm ashamed to say this, but I went through probably like 50 different videos just laughing. I also love that the parents are so open to getting like these just crazy, cringy, just outrageous responses in the comments and they weren't so, I don't know, they weren't just like, ugh, I'm gonna delete that video or I'm gonna private the comments because I don't want anyone to see that. Come on, it's just a joke and the fact that you put it out there knowing that this trend is kind of savage in the comments, like, thank you parents for those of you who filmed your kids, had people comment, didn't delete the comments, I seriously thank you because it made me laugh. If you liked today's video, please, please, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. It really, really helps me out as a creator and like I always say, this is your life. These are your decisions. Live your best life. I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.